In the world of motorcycle audio, there's a couple key components that make a sound system a sound system. But is it arguable that the source unit is one of the most important pieces of that puzzle? And when it comes to source units in the motorcycle audio category, there is one brand that has been absolutely dominating with their innovative and exclusive designs. And I am talking about the folks at Precision Power. We are talking motorcycle audio today, guys, and it's going to be a good one. We've got Ronnie Brashear in the studio with us, and we're going to go deep and even talk to you about some new products. This is CMA Networks presented by Sirius XM, all about precision power motorcycle audio. And it starts now. What's going on, everybody? And thanks for tuning in to another CMA Networks presented by SiriusXM. I'm your host, Ben Wu, and we are talking about motorcycle audio this month. And we've saved a good one here to, towards the end. This brand has evolved so much within this category, and it's become such a staple and a solutions provider, especially in the source unit category. I mean, let's be honest. There is no other brand offering the type of solutions that these guys are right now, especially for whether it's the 13 and unders and the 14 and overs. We're bringing features like Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, but I'm not going to steal that thunder, Ronnie. Don't worry, because Ronnie, you're going to tell us right now, what are we going to be covering today? Ben, we're going to be covering everything from head units to speakers to amplifiers today. And we have a lot of exciting stuff to talk about. Ronnie, I'm pumped just as you are, but before that, we've got to give an opportunity to our good sponsor, SiriusXM, to remind dealers out there why it is so important to sell SiriusXM. And when we come back, we're going to dig right into Precision Power Motorcycle Audio. Don't you dare go away. Hey guys, Ricky Lima here from SiriusXM. I had a chance to speak to some dealers and ask them what they love about selling SiriusXM. Here's what they had to say. Coast to coast coverage. I love SiriusXM for commercial free music. It's a great add-on sale and a profit opportunity. We love selling Sirius XM because you can listen to the same channel coast to coast. Profitability and ease of installation. It's a no-brainer. We love selling Sirius XM for its ease of installation, great profitability, and its reliability. People love it. Well, let's dive right in. Lots to cover today, lots of different categories, but I think it only makes sense, Ron, if we start from the top. Amazing selection of source units. We're going to tell the dealers tuning in all about them, and we're going to start with a very important one in the HDHU 9813SG. Ronnie, can you tell us all about this very important unit? The SG just released two weeks ago. Um, out of all the radios that we have manufactured, this has been the most anticipated out there, um, more than the 14 plus, more than the SI combined. People have been waiting on this radio. And I think that is because there are more street glides on the road in the 98 to 13 category than any other bike. So we knew that we had to do something for these riders to get their technology upgraded and into the 2023 20, year. And so what we did for them, we took a DIN radio and we looked at that fairing and we created a way to give them a seven inch high definition big screen that is waterproof, IPX6 rating, looks fantastic, uh, gives them Sirius XM, which is a great sponsor for you, Ben, and um, Android Auto, CarPlay two ohm stable amp built in. Um, we also noticed on the dash, and this is an important feature of this radio. To create the big screen, there are four lights that were going to be blocked. It was high beam, right and left signal, and oil pressure. So we were gonna block those icons. So what we decided to do is we built those icons into the top of the radio. So they are now high def icons instead of those small icons from the factory. Our radio is plug and play. And in this situation, it is also plug and play. You will unplug those lights from the fairing 
and we created the exact same connector coming out of the back of our radio, plug that in, and those uh, indicator lights now work on your radio in high def. Much bigger icon. Uh, it's a beautiful, beautiful looking radio. Again, I keep saying it, plug and play. We've added both plugs. If you've got rear speakers from the factory, those plug right in. You are good to go. Um, all thumb controls are built into this radio, so there's no outside modules. There's nothing that you would ever need to add. You could actually buy this radio, install it on the bike, and it is good to go with nothing more to add. Uh, to put this radio in, it will take you longer to get the fairing off than it will to get the radio installed up and play. You shop owners better rejoice. That is a brand new release from, from Precision Power. Congratulations, Ronnie, to your team um, on that unit. I know it's highly anticipated. And the, the little, I guess, part that you added on top, you know, it just shows that you guys really know what you're doing. And you thought of every little detail. All this exciting news, we are now going to segue kind of back to the beginning on the very first original radio that kind of got you guys um, into this entire market and really made a name for you. And we're talking about, of course, the HDHU 14 Plus model, Ronnie. It's so important that we talk about this model because this continues to be a top seller. Ben, you're correct. It is still one of our number one sellers and it got everything started. Um, it's amazing that it's been two years since this radio was released. Um, we've done multiple software updates for guys. They, they, we listened to our dealers and they, and they wanted more features or they wanted it to do this or do that. And we made those soft gray, uh, software upgrades for them to make it happen. Um, th this radio started on the back of a napkin in a restaurant one night with me and my program manager, Brandon. And uh, we were talking and I'm like, we've got to get into this market and off to the races we went. We are the still the only one that gives you a factory fit and finish, bolt up, plug and play radio um, in the 14 and up segment. And um, we, uh, we, partnered with uh, Skosh for the thumb modules, and that allows all your thumb controls to work through this radio. Uh, we gave you Android Auto and CarPlay, um, USB, and we utilized the factory connection. So the factory USB, the factory antenna wire, we put those factory plugs on the back of this radio so it would interface with all the wiring that was already in the fairing so that you would not have to change anything. Um, fantastic uh, radio. Again, it's the one that started it all. And then the head units to follow have morphed from this particular head unit. And like Ronnie said, evolution happens and these models continue to grow and add extra features and i think you dealers have a lot to do it with it according to ronnie so we're going to talk about now the evolved version on the hdhu 14 si with advanced integration features ben you are 100 correct this next radio the si uh was a huge advancement from the hdhu 14 plus uh, matter of fact we partnered with some of your countrymen up there maestro idata and uh, they helped bring us into a whole new world of things that we needed to be the best within this market. And many of the guys were asking for they needed uh, oil pressure pop up like the factory radio. They needed a low fuel pop up like the, the factory radio. Uh, they needed a way to turn on boom one and boom two amplifiers the HDHU 14 plus could not do that. So utilizing uh, Maestro technology, we have now been able to kick those factory amplifiers on uh, through the MRR. Uh, and Maestro has been so gracious to us. You know, we send them requests all the time and, and they have continued to listen to us like we listen to our customers and build technology into 
the MRR firmware and it just keeps getting better and better. Uh, the SI has Sirius X XM capabilities, which the 14 plus did not. Um, Android Auto, CarPlay, it has a two ohm stable amplifier, amplifier built in. That way you can plug this radio right into a factory system with nothing else and it will power the Harley two ohm speakers. So if you're looking for a higher technology driven radio for your uh, Harley Davidson, the HD HU 14 SI is the radio you want to look at. Now it seems like we've got everything covered, but we did forget an important category, Ronnie. What about for the road glide owners out there? They need love too, don't you think? Ben, we showed those road glide riders some love. Um, this bike was probably the hardest one that we have done simply because of the shape of the fairing. And the DIN radio from the factory was inside an oval housing. So we sat down one night and we were like, how in the world are we going to pull this one off? So what we came up with, and Brandon was genius with this one, we came up with a oval shaped radio and a waterproof gasket on the back of that radio so that when it slides into that oval hole, it seals all of that up. Water cannot get into the fairing. Once that was figured out, the features just started rolling in. Uh, Sirius XM, which they couldn't have before. Android Auto, CarPlay, they couldn't have that before. Uh, USB, they didn't have a USB from the factory. So what we created was a USB coming out of the back. So now they have access to USB for their music or for CarPlay, for Android Auto, all these features that they didn't have with that old technology. So road glide users, road glide riders, uh, if you're looking for a radio, the HD HU 9813RG is the radio for you. Now, if you thought it's only source units that Precision Power uh, provides, you'd be mistaken because like we said at the top of the show, we are talking about multiple categories here for you guys to truly build complete systems for your customers. So the next topic we're going to be talking about are speakers. Now, within speakers, there are two different ranges. The first one we're going to discuss is the MAS series of speakers. And uh, Ronnie, why don't you break that down for us? MAS speakers, they were built around the everyday rider, Ben. Uh, we wanted these guys to be able to pull those boom speakers out that they always complain about and be able to just replace it with something plug in, play, ready to go. Um, so we created the MES speakers. They come in four ohm. They come in two ohm. Um, if you could pop up the six and a half on the screen, that is our six and a half. It's fully waterproof. You could fill that up with water right now and um, no water would leak into the fairing. And if you'll flip that over, shows the neodymium magnet, very lightweight, um, and it holds a lot of power. These are 150 watts RMS. And two ohm stable, we use those in a factory type installation where they pull their boom speaker out and put it back in because Harley only offers their systems in two ohm. Or if somebody's building a system, we also offer these in four ohm so that you can um, parallel them together and get that two ohm rating with two pair of speakers. Um, could we put up the six by nine? This is our technology driven speaker. Now this came from the fact we were watching other manufacturers uh, with neodymium bag magnets in the bags of these Harley Davidsons, I don't think anybody ever thought that a rider would get on his bike and, and ride for seven or eight hours with the thing full blast. Now, I agree, riders only know two volumes, off and all the way up. But what was happening is the Neo Magnet would get so hot on those long rides, it would get hot enough to burn through a leather jacket, anything that could be up against it. So what we decided to do, if you'll flip that speaker over, 
Notice how there's no magnet hanging off of the back. I didn't want to get into that. So that is just a plate. That is not a magnet. And we'd loaded the Neo in the pole that's holding the tweeter. And if you look really close at the tweeter, those indentions right there are actually a heat sink. Ben, if you could cue that infrared picture. And everyone, if you look at this picture, this is live after being on for an hour, showing how the heat sink pulls the heat up the pole and keeps that heat out of the bag. So you never have to worry about damage to anything that's in the bag that would be right up on, on the, the back of the speaker. You'll never have to worry about that. Plus, seven or eight hour ride, we use nature to keep the speaker cool. That wind blowing over the top of that speaker carries that heat away. So it just naturally takes care of itself. Uh, I'm not surprised, Ronnie, to be honest. You guys are always on the cutting edge of technology and always coming up with innovative designs. And having said that, I think this is a great segue to introduce your brand new, yes, brand new set of speakers in the HT series. And if I'm not mistaken, if my Intel is right, these are going to play loud and play efficient. Ben, you're absolutely right. Again, we listen to our customers. Uh, while they like the MAS and just being able to replace factory speakers, not all riders are built the same. Uh, a lot of riders just like it loud. And uh, what's fantastic about this segment of business evolving is the 80s and 90s guys like me that had that experience of loud in their car now want it on their motorcycle. So we came out with the new. HT series of speakers, super efficient speaker. We utilize neodymium again. Um, it does have a horn tweeter, but unlike some of our competitors' brands, the horn tweeter isn't as harsh. Uh, that melt your face high that uh, sometimes comes out of these tweeters. We toned it down and raised the mid bass. So while you've still got that loud horn tweeter sound, it is not um, as face melting as some of the other stuff that's out there. If we could throw up the pictures of the new HT speakers. And guys, if you look at this, this is a uh, speaker built with neodymium and they hold 200 watts RMS. Currently, they come in 2-ohm only on a 4-ohm voice coil for the guys that wanted 4-ohm. But these are for that customer that says, hey, I want it loud and clear. And there are a ton of those customers out there. This is the series you want to put them in for loud and clear. Now, we've arrived at the last piece of the puzzle, and that is, of course, amplification. Ron, what? are the solution or what is the solution that precision power has when it comes to powering all these drivers and everything else we've talked about today? Ben, of course we had to have a power plant to run all of these speakers. Uh, but in development, we knew that it was going to have to have a small footprint. It was going to have to be super efficient because of the Harley electrical system. Um, we had to watch out how this thing grounded all of these good things to make it work on a Harley Davidson, which is much different than a car. Uh, we were able to accomplish that on dyno at four ohm. This amplifier will give you a hundred Watts per channel real on dyno at two ohm. This will give you 170 Watts of constant RMS power. If we could bring up a picture of the amplifier, so there is your footprint right there. Um, do we have anything there? We've got a pen. This will show you the footprint of this amplifier. Uh, Dave, if you'll bring up the one side so we can show everyone the connections. So here we've got um, your high pass, low pass crossovers, um, switchable uh, to four speaker configuration, high level in, uh, amplifier. So flip it over to the other side, and these will be all your power connections. 
And the reason that we separated the connections from the input is simply because we wanted to keep uh, noise down as much as possible. If you put the power connections to the power or the speaker inputs on the other side, you tend to pick up noise and we didn't want that to happen. So that's why we separated it like that right there. Ben also, um, the amplifier, we made two plug and play kits for this amplifier. We have the HD13.AWK, which is for 98 to 13 uh, Harley Davidsons. And we have the HD14.AWK, which was for the 14 and up. Plug and play kit for this amplifier. The only thing that you would have to run is power and ground to the battery. Otherwise, utilizing our kit, we give you a mount plate that goes on top of the radio. Uh, we give you a plug and play set of plugs, your inputs, your outputs, everything is plug and play utilizing these amplifier kits. Ronnie, I'm feeling a little silly right now because I said we're at the end, but how could I forget what we have to talk about here, which is the unique subwoofer solution that Precision Power has invented. Yes, quite literally invented for Harley Davidson specific. I need you to tell the dealers tuning in why this is such a special solution um, to get a little bit more bass out of motorcycle audio. How could you forget about our subs? Man, this was a challenge and a two-year plan to get these to market. Um, we saw what other competitors were doing, and, and, and they have great solutions out there, but you have to cut the side of the bag out. And cutting the side of a bag out of a $35,000, $40,000 bike makes me a little nervous. Um, it also, it's hard to keep water out. Once you cut that bag, and I don't care how you do it, you're not keeping water out. Um, many of our competitors sell in pairs. You you don't have to buy ours in pairs. You can pick, pick brake side or clutch side uh, to buy the subwoofer. You can buy them in a pair if you like, but you can also buy them in singles. But ours, what makes ours unique, you don't have to buy a separate amplifier. We built the amplifier into the enclosure. Uh, we give you two six by eight down firing subwoofers. Uh, very high efficiency, very high power rating. But the key to all of this, Ben, was how do we get the sound out of the bag without cutting the bag? So what we came up with is I walked in to program management and I'm like, there has got to be a membrane out there that lets sound out, but keeps the elements from getting into the bag. And they all kind of looked at me, but I knew it had to be there. And they went to work and they found this membrane. So what we've created is this honeycomb plug that has this membrane built into it. And you will drill 10 two inch holes into the bottom of your bag. We supply the template with the subwoofer. So there's no messing up. It drops right into the bottom of the bag and you drill out the holes that we have, we have shown you to drill. Then these, these honeycomb plugs go up into those holes and actually screw down. Um, we thought about using a pressure fit, but we were worried that maybe, you know, just the vibration of a Harley Davidson may knock them out at some point in time. So we gave you a screw nut to screw those down. So key here, you don't cut the side of your bag. Water's not going to get in. Sound is going to get out. And what's great, you can remove the bag or you can remove the box and then utilize your bag. Even though there's holes in the bottom of your bag because of that membrane, water's not going to get back in there. So you can utilize that bag to pack up, go to a rally, whatever you would like to do. So that was Ronnie Brashear from Precision Power giving us the lowdown on all the amazing products that are available for motorcycle audio. Pretty serious stuff. And if you're interested in finding out more information, then I certainly encourage you to check out their website, MotorcycleAudio.com. What a wicked website. Um, now, if you happen to be a Canadian dealer tuning in, then you need to know that the exclusive distributor for Precision Power in Canada is now Gemsend. And you can find them at Gemsend.com. On that note, 
we've reached out to our good friend and national sales manager, Mr. Dave Singh, to join us on this broadcast so I could get a little bit of his perspective. Now, Dave, you've seen all the great products that Ronnie presented today. I have one, well, two questions for you. The first one being, what do you think about this lineup? How excited are you that you are now offering precision power motorcycle audio to our Canadian dealers? Hey, Ben. Thanks for having us back. Really excited about this new lineup. Uh, obviously, as you mentioned, it's our, our newest addition to the Jemson family, and it's fit in quite well. Our dealer response to the brands has been fantastic. Um, we got our first taste of it back at the CMA Expo, and um, uh, the owner of the motorcycle, we put it in, you know, put it in himself because we're on the time crunch. And, you know, the product is so easy to install that the owner was able to put it in himself, uh, figure out everything on his own. Like Ronnie said, it's plug and play and it really lends itself, you know, to the do it yourself or should you want to go down that road. So the product uh, family growing is also very exciting. The newest head unit that's coming out. I mean, we're getting phone calls every day about that source unit. People are dying for it. We're in the middle of summer, you know, people have got their bikes on the road. Uh, we couldn't be more happier to have a brand like this as part of our portfolio of premium brands. Dave, I think sometimes in life and in business, timing is everything. So let's remind the dealers why timing is right now the best time to become the newest precision power motorcycle audio dealer in their neighborhood. The time is now to become a motorcycle uh, dealer for upgrading uh, motorcycles that are on the road because it's spring it's it's summer actually and these are uh, the times that guys are going out on these long road trips and one of the things that guys want to do when they're taking those low, long road trips is enjoy their music and if you've got an older bike and uh, it doesn't have bluetooth or you know you're just stuck with maybe cd or am fm the best way to take your older bike into the Today, today's modern age is to do a technology update. And that would start with the source unit. All of these source units are purpose built. They're not taking conventional source units and just, uh, you know, rejigging, uh, mounting um, um, fairings and, and that sort of stuff. They've, they've done their research. They've done a lot of engineering and they've come up with solutions that are plug and play. And that's the most important thing. Plug and play, ready to go. There's no cutting of wires or anything like that. And that will take a guy that may be, you know, a little bit upset with his, you know, 10, 15 year old bike that feels a little bit long in the tooth to falling in love with it again with the latest and greatest in technology. So uh, dealers definitely want to cash in now or take advantage of the opportunities because let's be honest, the motorcycle owners are also more mature and they have the money and the funding to do these kind of upgrades, whether it be mild or wild. In closing, and I reflect on the innovation that Precision Power has put into this segment, motorcycle audio wasn't even a thing that long ago, and now it seems to be all the rage. There's tons of energy, investment, resources, brands, all kinds of activity happening in the segment. Don't need to look further than right here on CMA Networks, where this has been literally one of the most popular sessions as far as categories is concerned for the last three years. And I suspect it is going to continue to grow. But to see Precision Power coming to market with new speakers, amplifier solutions, very unique subwoofer solutions, and yes, those awesome source units, it is a sight to behold and certainly something that you as a dealer should take strong consideration of. I want to give a big shout out to both Ronnie Brashear as well as Dave Singh for joining us on today's show. And on that note, this has been CMA Networks production brought to you by Sirius XM. I'm your host, Ben Wu. Until next time, we connect. There's never been a better time to have Sirius XM with over 150 channels in your vehicle. Your Platinum Plan offer includes more than ever before to enjoy online, on your phone, or at home. Create your own ad-free personalized stations powered by Pandora. Hear ad-free extra channels and enjoy favorite shows with Sirius XM video on demand. What you love is on now.